Hello, may I speak with Tim Gallagher, please? Who's calling? This is Christopher Meslinski. Okay, hold on. Thank you. Christopher Meslinski. Um, this call is being recorded for quality purposes. Uh, I just got off the phone with the district attorney's office of Erie County. Yeah. And they said that you were my lawyer. And uh, I'm trying to figure out what's going on here. And um, th they said uh, that there was a warrant on the way. I'm not sure what that means. But I was just trying to figure out if they were bringing it. Pardon me? Where is your case pending? Um, uh, North Collins, I, I guess there's some matters, um, North Collins. I was trying to fi find out from uh, District Attorney's Office uh, what, what charges they were bringing uh, against me, if any. And uh, okay. they didn't really, uh, th they said there was a matter uh, in, from May 3rd, and they said uh, there was a matter from um, last July. So um, okay. can you shed any light on this for me? County District Attorney's Office at uh, 716-858-2400. Okay. Christopher, the spell you, is it M-S, M-E-S? Yeah, M-E-S, M-E-S-L-I-N-S-K-Y. I don't recall ever meeting you, Tim. Uh, What's that now? I don't recall ever meeting you, but... Yeah, that's why I'm, I'm, I'm at a loss here. I, what I think may have happened was... Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so, I was assigned back in February to represent you on one of your cases, uh, the town of North Collins, on an assault third, it looks like a DWI, and a 511. What's a 511? Um, a suspended license. Oh. So then, you were in and out of custody for a period of time, correct? Um, and they did not bring you to court on a prior occasion to North Collins. And yeah, re familiar? yeah. Recently, that happened. Uh, there was a court date, and then they never. Uh, they said it was canceled when I was in jail. I was falsely arrested, falsely imprisoned um, last month. Okay. And then you. So that that, that was in probably June that you were not brought out. To, to, to court, so it was adjourned to July. Uh, and then I had it happen by the court in July to make the appearance, but there you, they determined that you were released from custody, um, and since you didn't appear, they issued a warrant. So that was probably sometime around, well, it could have been actually June 20, 26th or maybe July 10th or something. I think I, I want to say it was late June. Oh, yeah? Um, you were in jail in April into May. Does that sound familiar? No. Or just in May? Um, May of um, 2022. That so was, you, you, so you have not been in jail in the year 2023? I have, yes, in the month of June only. Or no, okay. I take that so back. That in March, in March, I, I was uh, I was in jail there for um for one day, one day and and uh and then uh in a few hours, thirty three hours, I was in jail. I was false arrest still. So the All set. So when uh, so you're saying um there was a court date in June. There have been court dates on your February incident since February. Um, what, there was what, what February incident? Time, oh, just stop, stop talking, please. Stop. Okay, okay. So, when I was assigned to represent you in February, there was 
a court date schedule that I can't recall right now because I don't have the file in front of me in March or April where you had been in custody and not produced. You were then found to be out of custody and the new court date was assigned. Uh, and then, that was in May, but then it was adjourned for some reason why I can't recall. And then the June date, I think you were in custody for, or the May date, whatever it was, there was this period of time where you were unavailable because you were in custody, or if you were in custody, they failed to bring you out. Huh. And there was one last final date in July or late June. Um, in fact, I thought, when did you get released in June? Um, I believe it was the 21st. Okay, that makes sense, because the 26th, I believe, was the warrant issue because you had failed to appear for court on the 26th. Have you moved recently? No. Yeah, I don't know why I'm getting, not getting service of, go ahead. How long have you been at the address that you currently reside at? Uh, years. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and what about a phone number? Have you had the same phone number? Uh, no. No? But Yeah, but uh, I don't, um, I don't accept a notification by phone. I, you know, I, I, I uh, need to be properly served. So I, I know um, when these hearings are coming up. I, I don't know why. And I called all around trying to find out because um, I was uh, discharged from, from uh, the jail with, with no paperwork. Well, that's an issue because they should have alerted you as to when your next court date is. Yeah. They were the ones that would be aware of it. So, right. All right. Well, let me, let me. Really, this. What is your address? Um, it's care of uh, two one five eight Seneca Road, Lawton's, New York. Uh, uh, Seneca Road, Lawton's, L A W T O N S. Yeah. What is it? One four. Oh, zero nine one. Zero nine one. Okay. Okay. Uh, in this number you're calling me from, is this your phone? Yes. And how long have you had this number? Oh, uh, not long. Okay. All right, so um, I guess the issue becomes, it is just Collins, or just North Collins Court, correct? Yes. All right, so I guess the issue becomes returning you to North Collins to have the warrant recalled. Um, yeah, I, I got no. What's that? Go ahead. I, you know, I, I, I'm trying to. Um, I want to go to court and resolve these matters. I'm just asking, you know, to be um, to be served with a summons for um court date. Uh, and um. Understood. Yeah. Understood. I'm going to reach out to the assistant district attorney for North Collins, uh, and find out when the next North Collins date is and then make arrangements to be there with you on that date so that the warrant can be recalled. Yeah, okay, so then there won't be a warrant then? Uh, could you let me know? Because, uh, man, this just stresses me out. Uh, uh, you know, they kicked my door in in June. And, you know, I still I haven't seen that warrant. And now you said there was a warrant uh, um, later that month in June? And I never heard anything about it. Has that been recalled or has there's been a warrant for my arrest all this time? There, there, I believe it's been a warrant for at least a month now. Is that right? Why, why won't, doesn't anyone notify me of these things? I, I, I'm struggling to find out myself because the court has a contact election form that would have been filled out at your arraignment to receive notices or summonses from the court. Um, so let me work on the return date and when we can return you on the warrant. Or you have the warrant recalled, so I don't have to worry about, um, you know, men coming and kicking my door in in the middle of the night. You know? Well, I mean, the warrant can only be recalled by the judge who issued it, uh, and I believe, I believe you had Judge Ricotta. Um, but let me, uh, let me determine when the next court date is and when we can get you back in front of the judge. I'll call you back at this number. Okay, do you, any idea when um, I might hear from you? If I 
can get a hold of the DA, I'll call you back today. If I can't get a hold of the DA, I'll call you back after I do speak to the DA. It could be tomorrow. Okay. All right. Okay. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Mr. Gallagher. All right. Okay. Bye. Thanks. Talk to you soon. Bye. Okay. Bye.